Medias called me a what? I'm not a better jungler than Medias. Medias is a god. Medias is an idol, dude. Like, you can't be better than your idols. I just cancelled my auto. Dang, not the greatest leash. But I cancelled my auto, so I deserve it. Welcome back, guys. Thanks so much for uh, friends commercials. So, I started W, um, got my E second. Uh, so yeah, I didn't miss much. For your W, make sure you always use it right after an auto, so you get that extra damage from my second auto, because it does reset your auto attack. So just remember that, right after your auto. So it looks like it's a uh, Kha'Zix mid who started Dornblade. That's actually pretty ballsy against a Katarina, because Katarina actually has decent poke. Um, so notice I'm uh, moving in between my attacks here. Oh, okay. It's one of the... Oh, okay, cool. I thought they were going to invade me, I guess not. I'm going to pop another health pot here. I'm right, gonna get my Q at level 3. I have a health pot running right now. I think what he did is he warded this side somewhere. That's what he was doing. So what I'm gonna do is instead of wasting my time trying to gank a warded side, I'm just gonna rotate through my jungle again. I'm just gonna go straight. Oh, okay. Careful. Maybe I can help him. Maybe. Probably not because he got hit by everything. No. Gonna pop a health pot here. That sucked. He kind of like got hit by everything there, so not much I could have done. I'm gonna see if I can try to gank mid or something. Oh, lag. Okay, server lag. That's fun. So what my Q does is it actually cancels gap closures like his E. So I'm gonna keep that in mind when he's trying to E away. Actually, I can just flash out against him. I'm actually glad he queued me instead of the Katarina there. Ah, that sucks that Jax came down. If Jax hadn't come down, we would have gotten a double kill or at least one kill there. But since Jax came down, um, we had to pay the price. Yeah, that really does suck. I did blow Kha'Zix's flash though, so that's good. He actually has no mana for his jump right now. If I could get one more auto, he would have died there. But I couldn't. Actually, maybe I could have if I was really ballsy, but... Imagine if I died double buffs to Kha'Zix there, that would have been pretty bad. Ooh, I'm so ballsy at the same time, I don't want to do it. No, I'm not going to do it. Alright, I'm just going to keep farming. I really want to hit 1k gold before I go back, but I don't think that's actually going to be possible here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to back right now. That sucks. So I'm gonna have to go Spirit Stone Boots route rather than Rush Mobilities. It's really nice to Rush Mobilities though. It gives you so much uh, jungle pressure. It's very easy to pull off ganks. Alright. So my blue's not gonna be up for another minute 50, so I'm gonna keep that in mind. Um, hopefully Renekton does a little bit better. It kind of sucked that Jax uh, got a free kill there, and then also... Uh, 
got Katarina. Yeah, pre-6 Katarina Rome isn't the brightest idea because it's very, very hard to get any kills that way. Okay, I should have smited earlier, I think, there. Just so my smite comes off cooldown a few seconds earlier. So I'm maxing my W, if you're wondering. I think they know I'm here. I think they're actually playing it very well. Pretending that I, I don't know. Because it just... Oh, what the hell? That was interesting. Ezreal, do it. Got one. Damn, does he not flash? He doesn't have flash. Okay. They could probably flash over him, though. No. Does she have a ward? Nope. She can get a Shun Po, though, over the wall. Oh, she does have a ward. Okay. And my blue won't be up for another 20 seconds, so it's not that bad. I shouldn't have let Lee Sin get the Q there, but, uh, oh well. It happened. I probably could have avoided the Q. Just gonna keep that in mind. Like, that, that can, I consider that a mistake, letting him Q me there. But at the same time, I was kind of like uh, supporting my team, so it wasn't like a, like wow, you're so dumb, you made that mistake. It just, oh well. I'm gonna put a ward here real quick, just so I don't get owned by someone. I'm gonna have my blue right quick. Katarina's not gonna need this blue. Um, she doesn't have a mana pool, and cooldown reduction does help her a little bit, but it's not that great because she's a reset champion. And generally, cooldown reduction on reset champions like Katarina or Kha'Zix. Um, Cooldown reduction is not a very good stat to get on them. Gonna keep farming. Their mid laner just went back. Their bot lane just went back. It would have been a good time to pull off a dragon, but at the same time, since we're so behind, um, it'd be super risky, so I'm probably not gonna do that. Uh, I'm probably just gonna farm my raisin and my red. I wish I had another health bot, though, because um, I'm not gonna be full HP. Oh, okay, well, I guess. How's top doing? 41 to 47, damn. Damn, I really don't like wasting time like this. Okay. I actually put a ward over there. Not because I'm worried about getting counter jungle right now, but just because uh, I think that'll benefit my mid laner and my top laner. I think he knows I'm here. Yeah, the way he's playing, he knows I was there. And it looks like Jax is coming to help him as well. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull these out. So he can't cue them. I think they're actually pulling off a dive on Katarina right now. Which I could probably counter gank pretty well. I'm coming. I really wish she stayed a little bit longer though. No wards? Nope, no wards. Uh, she took a turret shot. I blew my ult for nothing. And he's dead too. I'm not gonna smite the cannon minion because if I smite. Actually. Nah, but. They do dragon, oh well. That really does suck. My team misplayed there pretty hard. Katarina took a turret shot. Um, for no reason. I really didn't want to ult there, but then I saw a chance of letting. Like, saving Katarina there. So I'm like, oh, maybe if I ult, she'll live. And then, uh. She died to a turret anyway, so it was like, oh, damn. I made it better to save my ult because now it's on a 100 second cooldown. I think they're grabbing their blue right now, so. They backed off. They might lose a few minions there. Nice, okay. So I'm going to say 1440 their blue around there. Um, Jay Duster, thank you so much for subbing. Welcome. So I timed their blue about 5 minutes after I think it died. Right, I'm going to go back here and get MOBAs. I could get my golem, but... Actually, let's get my golem. I think because their team is so fed, I think golem would benefit me more just to make me more tanky. So when I do go to gank like bot lane or mid lane, I won't get absolutely destroyed. So I think that's actually more beneficial. Yeah, this really does suck. 68 to 33, 85 to 67, 61 to 68. I mean, at least top lane's doing okay. You know, you gotta be uh, positive in your games. Otherwise, you won't get 
really anywhere. My ult's almost up, which is gonna be nice. Damn. Can't really do anything in there. Uh, this is really ballsy of him. Like, oh wow! I think he might die there. Nice. Right, okay, that's actually worth for me. I got a shutdown off that. Actually, no, because they did get an assist. But oh well, that was really, really ballsy of them. Actually, no, it is worth because they. Oh, never mind. We both blew flash. I'm like, yeah, they blew flash, but still. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can gank bot. Bot's gonna be a difficult lane to gank right now. I probably should have went, uh, gotten a sweeper just to see if I can sweep a couple bushes in bot lane. I'm standing here because I'm thinking this is warded. Looks like they backed off for Katarina. So my blue should be up in about 30 seconds, so that's why I just smited just now. I think Dragon's gonna be there. It's like. If they start a dragon, we really can't contest it. We don't have the damage for it. Katarina's way too weak. Like she, Katarina doesn't even have an intermediate item yet. She just still has an amp. So like she has starter items, so we're just gonna have to give it up. Which is kind of unfortunate. But if we did fight it, what would end up happening is we just end up losing more than we would have um, from just giving up the dragon. So my blue's gonna be up right now, though. Twelve twenty-six. I'm looking at least instant. Yeah, he's going straight for it. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm actually gonna ward the bush. Because if their bot line decides to help them, okay, so at least I can uh, have vision of, you know, smite range. Um, okay, I'm just gonna start it. It looks like Caitlyn's bot, so I'm no worry. He needs to pull this, though. Damn, he got it. No, oh, I'm gonna die here. Unless Katarina pulls something off crazy. Oh well. Yeah, they're just ridiculously strong at this point. It's kind of unfortunate. I actually did not expect to at least in a queue it there because he saw three of us here, but he still took it anyways. Yeah, they kind of just suck. I think they got dragon as well. I'm gonna estimate timer dragon, 1930. Is top lane gonna die? Damn, top lane died too. Wouldn't be surprised if Lee Sin tries to counter this. I'm probably not gonna be able to get Sunfire this game just because of the fact that like we're so behind as a team. So I might just have to go, um, Randuins. I'm not gonna win that. On the plus side, our late game is pretty strong, but I don't know if we can actually get to it. I'm gonna go back here. Man, that seemed a little excessive. I actually did not expect that burst. Actually, if Ezra picks up someone here. No, never mind. Yeah, mistake on my part. I shouldn't have done that. I didn't expect them to do that to me, but they did. I 
I think he could have killed him there, honestly, with a Q. <laughs> I think she could have saved him too. Damn, this game's not going too well. I think right now it's just like the fact that they're just so fed, I can't really do much at all. And I'm under, I'm definitely underestimating their damage output. Yeah, definitely underestimating their damage output. Mm. Game's not looking too great right now. Kind of lost pressure around the map. Um, like all my laners did kind of poorly. Um, I wouldn't say the jungler really influenced anything except for top lane. Like top lane, he got he got a pretty free kill though. Like Renekton was really pushed out, and he actually got lane ganked. Like he got hit by two Qs, two or three Qs, which is you know a little bit too much. Like it's it's not very hard to dodge these in Qs. And then he also got ghosted. On, like I don't know. It just seemed like he got killed by like a Jax who didn't even have his stun up yet. Or not up yet, but he didn't even have a point in his stun. He had his Q and his W. I think the best thing we can hope for right now is they try to do Baron or something and we can steal it, but... If we could get to super late game, like, you know, actually no, like... Katarina and Renekton are just way too weak right now. And uh, Ezreal went tier when he's super like behind. Not good. You can't you can't afford to go tier on like 80 carries if you're behind. At least that's what I've known from experience. I don't know, maybe an 80 carry main thinks so, uh, differently, but for the most part I don't think tier is a very good item on uh anyone when they're behind. I saw him to cancel his jump there, but uh, I didn't hit him in time. Attack speed? No, hyper penetration is much better than attack speed. Uh, so Juani doesn't gain anything from attack speed. I need to get a really good ultimate off. Well then, that's a lot of damage. I think this might be a forfeited game. Unfortunately, I just can't do anything at this point. Yeah, no, it, uh, it's just why he doesn't gain anything from attack speed, it's, it's not good to do. Uh, Humbles, thank you so much for subbing, welcome. <laughs> when in doubt, Cthulhu. Right? I really hope they get him. Okay, he's dead. Oh my gosh. Oh well, GG. That kind of sucks. Those kind of games are not really worth playing out. Um, I don't think a lot of people are saying Sejuani sucks. Please never play Sejuani.